Here we have the ES Artipil 4 Touch two channel wireless programmable room thermostat. Now, this is another alternative within our programmable thermostat range. Within the box, you will find the receiver unit, the thermostat itself, which you'll notice has an exceptionally large display, and the stand for the thermostat if you opt to have it stand mounted as opposed to wall mounted. An additional upgrade to this unit is it can be made Wi-Fi compatible using the ES Wi-Fi hub. And if you come with me, we're gonna jump across to the other room where we're gonna run through some instructional videos for homeowners and end users. Setting the time and date. First, wake up your thermostat and press the menu button. The first option will be set time. Press select enter. And your first option will be between 24 hour and 12 hour. Simply use the up or down arrows to flip between and select once you have chosen your preferred option. This will then take you onto hours. Again, up and down arrow to amend, select once confirmed. Onto minutes, up and down arrow to amend and select once confirmed. This will then take you to the date. This will start with the day. Again, up or down arrows to amend, select once confirmed. Up and down to select the month, select once confirmed. And then onto the year, up and down arrows to amend and select once confirmed. Selecting your heating schedule. To select your heating schedule, tap the menu button, then use your up arrow to get to option number five, set schedule. Press select. You will first have the option between heating and hot water. Use the up or down arrow to choose your option. Press select. This will take you to your scheduling options between five and two day, weekends and weekdays are varied, seven day where each day is set independently, and 24 hour where every day is set the same. Once you've selected your option, press select and the screen will show saving. Selecting between four or six timed events. First, wake up the thermostat screen and hold down the menu button until you see RF setup appear. Now use the up arrow until you get to option three, program events. Now use your up or down arrow to select between four and six events. Press select and saving will appear. Programming your thermostat. To program the ES RTP4 touch, simply press the menu button up to setting number three, heating and hot water, and press select. You will now have the option to select between heating and hot water. In this example, we're going to heating, press select. This will now give you the options to flick through your daily options, your start time, your end time, and your temperatures. Press select to go through. As we see here, this is our start time. You can use your up and down arrows to amend the time. And once happy, press select to move to the end time for this timed event. Once we're happy and press select, you can then amend the temperature using the up and down arrow and select to move to the second programming function. The starting time of P2 will always be the end time of P1 and this will follow suit through all programming options depending on whether you have four or six programmed times throughout. Continue this process until you have set all timed events available. Frost protection mode. To set the frost protection mode on this unit, first wake up the thermostat by tapping the home button. Then we hold down the up and down arrow simultaneously for approximately three to five seconds. Then you will see off appear on the screen and the set point temperature will show as five degrees. In this mode, the heating system will only engage if the ambient temperature drops below five degrees Celsius. This is a safety feature. To select the manual mode, first wake up the thermostat by pressing the home button and press mode until manual appears on the screen. This will now put the thermostat into manual mode, meaning you can control the set point temperature by simply using the up or down arrows to increase or decrease the set point temperature. Heating and hot water options. As this is a two channel thermostat, it is capable of controlling both the heating and the hot water. Preset to heating only, you can amend this to heating and hot water by waking up the thermostat using the home button, holding the menu button until RF setup shows, 
press your up arrow to option number five, heating type, press select and amend from heat only to heating and hot water with either the up or down arrow and pressing select. The screen will then show saving. Manual override using the receiver unit. To override your heating and or hot water, simply on the receiver unit, press the left hand button to override your heating with the flame icon or the right hand button for your hot water with the tap icon. Repairing the thermostat to the receiver unit. In the event that your thermostat and receiver unit become unpaired, there is a simple process to fix this. First, on your receiver unit, hold down the right hand button under the tap icon until the left hand button starts to flash red. On your thermostat unit, wake this up with the home button, then hold the menu until you see RF setup. Press select and the thermostat will begin to repair with the receiver unit. Setting optimization. To set the optimization settings, simply press the home button to wake up the thermostat and hold down the menu button until you see RF setup. Use your up arrow to get to setting option two, optimization. Press select and you can choose between optimum stop and optimum start. Simply use your up and down arrow to select between, select to access and use the up and down arrow to pick between on and off for each option. To enter the technical menu, first wake up the thermostat, then hold down the menu button until you see RF setup on the screen. Press the down arrow once until you see installer settings and hold select until installer settings becomes technical settings. Here you are in the technical settings mode. Within this menu, you will have access to settings such as low protection set point, TPI, and landlord service interval reminders. For more information, please refer to the manuals provided. Pairing to Wi-Fi. To connect the Wi-Fi hub and unit, first hold the Wi-Fi button on the Wi-Fi hub until the left-hand button, RF, starts flashing green. On the thermostat, press the home button to wake the thermostat up and hold the menu button until RF setup is displayed. Now press select to pair the unit to the hub. You will see saving on the screen.